obviously... You're not looking happy about what you're no, hearing. No, I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not happy about the whole kind of humanist um, doctrine that, you know, they, they want to kind of, you know, force down people's throats. No. Um, I'm asking for... <laughs> that's, that's, that's effective. And what's, what, what's, what's funny is, like, you know, they're trying to copy um, the very things that the Bible does. Are you worried about the teachers in, teachings in the schools as well? I you? think, yeah, I think that's another issue as well. Mm. You know, teaching young people about, you know, basically saying that there's no God. Um, what do you, how I do you feel about teaching young people uh, uh, evolution? I think that's, yeah, I think that's a lie. Um, I genuinely, <laughs> genuinely think mm. that's a lie. Mm. Um, because if we, if, I, if we are evolving, mm. what are we evolving to? Mm-hmm. Um, and I sometimes no, worry. Can, can, can I make this point as well? Mm. If we are subject to matter, time, and space, yeah. then if it's finite, how did it come to being? Mm. Okay, so, right. Well, I'll answer that. There I'll has to be a God outside <laughs> um, of time no, and I want, space. I want to respond to, to what I've There's quite a lot to go on there. Yeah. But just yeah. respond but to just, what, what, just yeah. jumping in very, very quickly. First of all, this idea that humanists and secularists are somehow aggressively forcing <laughs> their ideas. Like, I, I don't know. I've lived in my house for about ten years, and I would say about once a fortnight, someone comes around and knocks on my door and tries to convince me to become a Christian or a Muslim, and on one occasion a Rastafarian. But nobody has ever come around my house to try to demand <laughs> that I adopt secular no, individual values. Now let me, mock, let me finish. You mock, you insult God. You... But what, like you were when you were no, saying no, about, no, but about this Andrew being <laughs> way late. No, let me just move straight on from you there. You have no idea let, about the historical finish, value please. of the Bible. You just, I have a great amount of idea about the historical value of the Bible, like, and it's rather like low. Um, let me finish. I think that we live in a very messed up society. If we say, aren't relationships great? Aren't long-term relationships great for our culture? Doesn't this add something to our society? Isn't this great? Let's celebrate them. And if this person wants to help people celebrate them mm. because he believes in a, in, in a person from 2,000 years ago who turned water into wine and, yes. and, and raised the dead and walked on water and all this kind of stuff, fair mm. enough. But if my cousin Sarah wants to do it, who's a lovely, warm-hearted, caring, reasonable, rational individual, well, we couldn't possibly accept that. Well, that is an absolute no, 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 no.